Hello, this is Joseph Hong, and I will be showing my level that has been built from a level editor from a game, Portal 2. And the reason why I wanted to show this level is because this was one of the pro this was one of the levels that I was most excited to make, and I feel and I feel like I I uh, bring from a lot more than the other two levels. Uh, since Portal 2 has been my favorite PC game, I wanted to um, I, I wanted to just try to build a, a good level and show that you know I could I, um, I could have my own chamber. So um, so this so this level is more towards people who are not familiar with the game. Uh, specifically, people who are not really familiar with the the mechanic of this game, which is um, how to use portals. So hopefully, uh, my aim is that by the end, by the time, by the by the time people finish my level, they will they will be more familiar with how to use these um, how to use portal guns in this um, solve more puzzles. So as you can see. All of the tiles are in black, and it, it, it won't do anything. Um, player who be player might be a bit confused why why there's a gun in the first place, but at least um, at the very least, the player now now learns that black tiles doesn't do anything. So now then the question is what to do next. And player will see some sort of an exit here, but there's really no way to cross. So, the player will see what's around him and just try to reach to somewhere. Yep, um, so now the player is at the top. The player will see four things. The player will see a button, the cube, the light bridge, and another button. So um, now the player knows that light bridges can have something on top of it, in this case a cube. So let's just press this. Okay, so the play so the player learned couple of things. First, pressing a button will deactivate this light bridge for um, for, uh, for, a, for, for, for a temporary time, which, uh, excuse me, uh, the, the, the button will activate, the, de the button will deactivate light bridge temporarily, which will cause the block to fall down and press, um, and press onto this square button. Which, which activated these two tiles to turn into the white tile. So, uh, quite, quite, a, uh, quite, a, quite a few things going on here. Mainly that buttons will, sim um, buttons will activate something, and yeah, that's that. So, um, having, so since since the player now sees a different color. We'll try to shoot and and now the player knows that the player can shoot portals on white tiles and portals connect to, from point A to point B and the light bridge is showing how it how it uh, how it works so since the light bridge is coming in this direction once it passes up the portal reach to this direction. It also conveniently becomes a bridge that connects between um, this room to the next room. Awesome. Now this room has a lot of white tiles so you can shoot anywhere. Just you know experimenting how it works. Also, the player can will know that um, as long as there are white tiles, 
support doesn't have to be shot from the from the side walls. It can be shot. That's the top. So now the next, so now the next, next, the next task is to um, move on from here. So the player click on it, and you'll see, and the player will see another cube and um, and another button with a light bridge at this corner. Since since the player can't really do anything. Um, un unless this button's been pressed, so... Okay, another set of portals. Grab the key. And place it on top of the button. So that now the player has access to... This bridge. Pressing this button... Will activate another set of tiles. So here's an exit. And here's a tilted tile, and what? And the player will just, you know, try to see how the light bridge works. And see that the bridge can also be tilted. So that's cool. And now, in order to figure out how to go to here, the player will try to think that where to set a sec another portal. So since um, since there's a blue portal that is initiating the connection, there should be another portal, orange one, that is here. And now the person goes here and enter the section, or I guess the second half. This is where the, the secondary mechanic is being introduced, which is lasers. It's one of the hazards that the player can't go across. And it won't really kill you, but it will have this sound effect with a, with a little knockout to indicate that, you know, it is dangerous and the player can't really go through it. So, the player will, be good. Um, the player will try to reach this button. And at this point, the player will realize that the player, um, the player can't really do anything until, unless there's a block here. So, the player will just go back. Thus a new entrance has been created which will lead to the final chamber. Now this is smaller and there's there's clear an exit over here. It's just there's just no way to go across from here to there since all of these all since it's been covered with black tiles and very risky to jump here all the way there. So pressing this will cause a light bridge, but there are set lasers that the player can go through. Additionally, there's a timer which means the player needs to act fast, or it will just it will just disappear and and needs to be activated again. So. Um, I'll just wait till the time reset, so I don't have to die. Um, 
directly passing through the player can still reach to this end by traveling this portal. And yep. So that was the end of the level. Um my experience with this level overall was it was it was being it was fairly fun. Um the level editor is very user friendly so I didn't have too much hard time um, designing the level itself, I was I was struggling with the idea of how to make how to build up to so that the the player that the level is not too boring but still um, have some difficult have some increasing difficulty so it so it feels good whenever the player finishes it. So I guess that was the that was the hard part. Um, I really I really enjoyed it. It, it was simple. There were there were a lot of content, and I feel like this would be, this would be one of the good tutorial levels, um, or or at least a, like the, the, the chap, chapter one or two. Um, yeah, um, that was my that was my commentary of my level. Hope you enjoyed it, and yeah, have a great day.